Hello there, I'm Delectable Lisa. It's July 2016 and I'm ready to do another unboxing. Today I have my BAM box. Oh no, something is spilling. Something just spilled out on me. No. I guess I better open it and find out what it is. <laughs> the theme this month is uh, galactic. There's some kind of sand going up. There's sand all over everything. I don't know what it's from. Oh, I have a one up card. One of my items has been upgraded to a limited edition item. Ugh. Yep. Whatever the sand is, it's pink. <laughs> Alright. Here is our pin. It says true love down at the bottom. And it looks like uh, Rocket Raccoon. Cute. Scared to open this. There's pink sand everywhere. Okay, this would be why there's pink sand everywhere. Oh, yep, because there's something metal jammed into this Mars space sand that never gets wet, but is now all over my living room. Lucky me. At least it won't get wet. sand all over our paper filler. Alright, and there's sand on this. <laughs> um, it's obviously a Star Trek item. Let's see, Star Trek pen. There are these other pins. I'm not sure what those pins mean, but I know that's Star Trek. Okay, Alien Resurrection. This is exclusive costume worn by the Origa crew. Has a piece of authentic wardrobe in it. And then on the back, it says, this card offered exclusively by the BAM box features an authentic piece of wardrobe worn by the Origa crew in the movie Alien Resurrection. This jacket was acquired by the production team for use by cast during filming. It was distressed for filming and features Origa United Systems military patches attached to the left arm. But I just have a, you can see the little bit of fabric. It's nice that it's actually like a screen worn item. off the sand. It almost got into the print. <laughs> it's a print signed. Um, a Green Lantern print that's obviously Sinestro. I'm not sure who the Red Lantern is, but it is a signed print and it is four of 250. Number four. It's pretty early. Okay. This is what cut open my sand. My poor sand. It got eliminated by Boba Fett. Now I'll read the card. There's so much pink stuff in the bottom of this box. All right, I don't know what was the upgraded item. Oh, the upgraded item was the art print. I think maybe it's hard to tell it. Um, you will 
For the first time, we have two artists in this month's BAM box, and these are BAM box exclusive prints. You will receive, receive either Thanos by Logan Pack or The Battle by Blake Henriksen. Watch out for the red one-up card to get the Thanos black and white variant or the Battle Red Lantern variant. I guess that's what we got. The Battle Red Lantern variant. Four of 250. That's our one up. So that's pretty cool. And that is by Blake Henriksen, is a Denver based illustrator who currently operates under the pseudonym Pink Havoc. Blake has worked on search properties as Star Wars, the card game, Star Wars X Wing Miniatures, Lord of the Rings, the card game, Warhammer, the living card game and Legends of Norath. His client list includes Sony Online Entertainment, Fantasy Flight Games, Cryptozoic Entertainment, Dire Wolf Digital, and Backflip Studios, to name a few. That's quite a few. The BAM Box Exclusive Authentic Wardrobe Card. Taken from a screen-used jacket worn by the Auriga crew in the movie Alien Resurrection in this BAM box exclusive authentic wardrobe card. Each card contains an authentic piece of the jacket worn in the movie. This is a BAM box exclusive limited edition piece. Obviously. Custom handmade steel Star Wars silhouette statues. We have the sand ruining Boba Fett. From the craftsmanship of Smitty Tut Designs come these custom handmade steel Star Wars silhouette figures made exclusively in this size for BAM box. Standing at 5 inches tall and made from forged steel, most will get either Yoda or Boba Fett, but 500 will get a yellow 1-up card and receive the 8-inch black Darth Vader. We have the 5-inch sand destroying Boba Fett. The BAM Box exclusive True Love Rocket Raccoon and Group Pen. I guess you could have got either a Rocket Raccoon or a Group Pen. We have Rocket Raccoon. Designer Nick Kakoza is back with this month's BAM pen. And for the first time, we have two pins you can collect. Our favorite love story from Guardians of the Galaxy, Rocket Raccoon and Groot. True Love, you will receive one of the pins and you will have to trade to get the set. You can trade at the BAM box slash community. Watch out for the one up card, which shows the black and gold variants. Didn't get either one of those this time, but I got the gold variant the last time that I got a pin. The Mars Space Sand. I'm not picking that up. <laughs> this amazing sand will not get wet. Dump it in a glass of water, remove it with a spoon, and it will emerge completely dry. The sand has the same properties as Martian soil and is used by scientists in NASA Mars exploration experiments. Oh, uh, there was a Gold Star Instant Winner card this month where you could have received a signed comic book. I didn't get that. And then they have the last item was the custom Star Trek The Next Generation badge and rank pin set. Step aboard the Starship Enterprise and choose your ranking with this custom badge and ranking Pips pin set. Die strip from a sheet of copper and individually hand polish it. Polished. <laughs> These badges are cosplay quality. So that's what the little ones, I didn't know what they meant were. Those are the ranking Pips. Once again, the BAM box is very good. It's always very good. You always get something signed. You always get exclusives. It's really cool that we got this screen-worn um, fragment, I guess. And it's really nice. Um, I wish the sand wouldn't have spilled all over everything. I didn't notice it was leaking this morning, but I definitely noticed it when I picked the box up. Anyway, I really like the box. I always do. Go ahead, give me a like and subscribe, and let me know what you thought.